we can still show up um, in a meaningful way this November and pull, as we did in 2020, pull our democracy again back from the brink. But Portia kind of touched on this. The motivator there has to be for people to understand, and it's up to us to do everything we can to help spread the word on this, that when you see those obstacles, they are not there by accident. They didn't just happen. Mm -hmm. It's not a bureaucratic glitch. It's not some back office breakdown. Somebody doesn't want you to vote. Like Raphael Warnock says, there are some people who don't want some people to vote. And so when you see something going wrong, receive it as somebody is trying to stop you from exercising your franchise and make that your motivation to redouble your efforts, to do whatever it takes you to climb over, around, under the obstacle that's in front of you to get to the ballot box, make sure your voice is heard. If we can get that kind of electoral energy um, in these midterms and beyond, then we create the next wave of pressure for the kind of policy in Washington that can deliver one America that respects the vote and lifts up the voice of every person in our country.